Didn't we go directly to camp? This is more important. Not for me. We're stuck here. Give me a leg up. Okay. Ah! Ow! Oops. It slipped. I thought you were clumsy, but you're also a wimp. Uh, you're just too heavy. What? It's not me, it's the armor. A dark hole. Something Sadwick would see as a metaphor for his life, I bet. For me, it's just a hole. Though, it is a pretty dark one. Over there, quickly. Oh no, what do we do now? Shh, no talking. Seekers have keen ears. Okie dokie. stories about silence. I'll just imagine this is a fairy tale, and I'm the Dragon Slayer, and the Dragon Slayer needs a spear. Why don't you just climb up there? Are you worried about the beautiful bark or something? Nonsense. Come on, work with me here. I don't think you have to punish the tree just because times are changing. Less talking, more kicking the tree. Damn it, Kira. Can you hear me? Hey! Damn, she's out cold. My respect, your majesty. Excuse my intrusion, your majesty, but it seems that your honor guard kidnapped my guy. Wanna trade? Absolutely circus worthy. Whoa, I think you're 
soothing her. deep. I need a safety net or something. Jeez, Kira. the hero of this story, this will work out just fine. Oh man, oh man, oh man. <laughs> Even the roots beneath the earth are too high for me. Maybe you didn't want to scare me, but I'm never scared. I'm not afraid of you. I can. The monster would see me. Now or next to... Greeny, what are you doing? <gasps> Have you lost your mind? Hey, hey, over here. Yes, I'm talking to you, you ugly brute. I can't. Looking stupid today, aren't we? Me. Oh, no way. You always look like that. Ha! Stupid and hunchbacked. Your legs are crooked as well. I mean, mine aren't perfect either, I must admit. But that's fine, because I don't no, use them to hunt on. down and scare innocent <clears throat> people. It's not important. <laughs> Just get to safety. Last chance. I'll count to three. One, five, seven... <laughs> three! You saved my life, little lady. You're amazing. And you're a big roly-poly bear. Yay!
cool. Now she'll land safely. It's fused to the cocoon, I'm sure. Let's see if I'm right. Ugh! Help me, Spot! Get you out of there. Come on! Gotcha! Whoa! Ah! No pulse. Can't hear a heartbeat either. Remember the kiss of love? Uh, life? How'd that go? Something. Thank God. Oh, 
shit! Are you trying to kill me? We were hoping it'd be more peaceful here, but, uh, doesn't seem to be. You're a strange one. Well, last time I was here, I was a clown. Welcome back. You okay? Guess so. What's that in your hair? What? What are you talking about? You have a strand of white hair. What? How'd that happen? I have no idea. Well, as long as it's only one strand. We should get out of here while those things are still calm. Okay. Oh crap, the bees are back. Oh no. Hey, the message. Give it to me. You can't seriously want to read that now. Let's move! Wait! I just want a quick glance. Damn it! We need to leave! Oh, are you kidding me? There's nothing on it! Give it to me! I missed you, little hopper. Oh, and you've got spots. Come here, Spotty. What's the news? And what happened to your hair? Don't you like it? So what's the message? It needs decrypting. It's probably the invisible ink and lemon cipher. No, wait. Maybe it's wax-based this time. And what do we do now? We need to find the mirror to get out of here. But why? It's such a nice place. Spot's here, and we'll probably meet Sadwick, too. Oh, I really love Sadwick. He probably looks exactly like you, but with a funny hat. <laughs> All right, look. If you find a clown's hat, I'll put it on for you, okay? Yay! I love silence. I always wanted to come here. But you know what being here means, right? It's a dream world. It's a world between life and death. And which side do you want to wake up on? If we want to live, we need to smash the mirror. Do you understand? Mm. Rini, listen. No matter what anybody tells you, or whatever happens, the most important thing for us is leaving this world. You remember how Sadwick did it? He smashed the mirror. What's with the whispering? What mirror? The one in the throne room. Do you know how to get to the throne room? Not from where we are right now, but I know it's high up. You reach it with a train that runs on the rail of clouds. How do you know about the mirror? I smashed it the last time I was here. How is that possible? Because I'm the King of Silence. That's right. It's true. Hey, come on. Enough with the whispering. Out with it. Forget that lunatic. He can't help us. Yeah. I think he's the one who needs help. There's something royally wrong with the King of Silence. Hey! I said stop. My brother isn't crazy. At least, not really. Hey, that's our last flare! Rini, put down that gun. Yeah, give it to me.
Leave her alone. Come on, little hopper. Sorry, I want to go home, Noah. I know. I don't like it here. Everybody's arguing and fighting. Why aren't you king instead of the false queen? Why is she so mean? And why'd she send those evil seekers? I want to go home. I'll get you home, I promise. But how? I'll find Janus and he'll take us to the throne room. He knows the way. Janus knows the way? Now get some rest. We'll need all the strength we can muster. Okay. Sleep, little hopper. And don't forget what Dad always said. We are... Like two clouds in the wind. No matter how far the winds drift us apart... We'll 